All right, guys. Now, since my storage is kind of down, I'm recording my bigger, longer projects on my iPad. So I'm going to be doing some YouTube shorts. And I'm going to be reading Crossover by Quam Alexander. And here we start. Here I am. Each time you play, it's all net. If anyone else called called me fresh and sweet, I'd burn mad as a flame. I know she's only talking about my game. See, when I play ball, I'm on fire. When I shoot, I inspire. The hoop's for sale and I'm the buyer. How I got my nickname? I'm not that big on jazz music, but my dad is. One day we were learning, I mean, listening to a CD of a musician named Horace Silver, and my dad says, Josh, this cat is the real deal. Listen to that piano fast and free, just like you and JB on the court. It's okay, I guess, Dad. Okay, did you just say okay? Boy, you better recognize greatness when you hear it. Horace Silver is one of the, is one of the hippiest. If you, if you shoot half as good as he jams, Dad, no one says ha hippiest anymore. Well, they ought to, because this cat is so hip. When he sits down, he's, stand he's still standing. He says, real funny, Dad. You know what, Josh? What, Dad? I'm dedicating this next song to you. What's the next song? One of the only the best song, the funkiest song, and so for Paris Blues album, Filthy McNasty. And it says here, or Silver Quintet, Filthy McNasty. At first, I don't like the name because so many kids made fun of me on the school bus, at lunch, in the bathroom. Even Mama jokes. It fits you so perfectly. So it fits you perfectly, Josh. She said, "You never clean your closet, and that bed of yours is always filled with cookie crumbs and candy wrappers. That's just plain nasty, son." But as I got older and started getting game, the name took on a new meaning. And even though I wasn't into that jazz, every time I'd score a rebound or steal a ball, Dad would jump up smiling and.